sex, Trisha. Meet Eric and his five wives. Polyamorism? Just as old as the Bible. I mean, Solomon had, what, 2,000 wives? Is that what you're aiming for? Well... <laughs> Find out all the dirty details. What do your friends and family think of this? My dad has no idea. He, he does now. Is this love? Who is the favorite? I, I am. am. Or something else? It isn't about quantity, it's quality. <laughs> On the next Trisha. <laughs> for 27 years. Now, about one year into their marriage, they decided to invite other women into their home and into their bed. Well, today, Eric and Wanda live a polyamorous lifestyle. You know what that means? Yeah. You will. <laughs> uh, currently, they are physically and spiritually married to four other women. Yep. <laughs> That applause came from the guys, but here's, here's their story. I'm Eric Floyd, and I'm the luckiest man on earth. I'm married to the goddess, Wanda D, and she is my rock. And I'm married to Amora Divine, a woman who knows that too much is never enough. And I'm married to Satai, my down for whatever girl. And I'm also married to Intigra, my firecracker. Oh, she gets things started. I'm also married to Charisma Sky, my newest spirit wife. And with her, the sky is the limit. Most men have this fantasy of being with more than one woman, or definitely going to bed with more than one woman. I do both, of course. You've gotta have a lot of stamina, mentally, spiritually, and physically. I always hear about Charlie Sheen and his goddesses. I've been doing goddesses since the 80s. You know, it's never easy when you have to find balance. And this is a show business household. Show is our business. Entertainment is our job. The reason Wanda and I have been together, successfully married, for 27 years, is because we never argue about the two things that break up all marriages. Money and sex. I met Wanda back in the early 80s. And the first year of our marriage, we were exclusive to each other. But then in that second year, she was not just a willing participant, but she was the initiator of us opening it up to others. People have to remember, the company's called Goddess Empire, and Wanda D is the goddess. We have Amora, Sate, Integra, and Charisma Sky. We'll meet them all a little later. But first, now, Wanda, apparently this was your idea right from the get-go. So how, how did you arrive at that? It was something that I fantasized about. Another guy in the bed with you? It started there, yeah. So was your first, <laughs> first sexual experience other than a couple was with a, what, a, a friend? Or? Yeah. yeah. I mean, to put it all in context, Wanda was hip hop's first female DJ. Yeah. And the movie Beat Street, cutting yeah. up on the turntables. Yeah. <laughs> and so we took her from DJ to hip hop's first female glamorous rapper. Yeah. And she became the first rapper to go platinum. Yeah. But she was called the goddess of rap, and she was very sexy and edgy. Mm -hmm. I noticed as her manager that she was really titillating on stage, but a bit of a church mouse off stage. So you go yeah. from that to let's yeah. get another guy into bed? Well, well it's like no, 0 to 60. No, it was, it, it happened in stages. I sort of noticed that what she fantasized and embodied on stage, mm -hmm. yeah. she, I, she wanted to take it into her real life. And I think the most gracious thing a man can do, any mate, is to let your spouse feel like they have fertile soil. Exactly. To grow in yeah. any way they want to. You're saying that uh, uh, for a guy to really understand and be with his partner and love his partner if his partner as, as mm -hmm. Wanda was saying you know mm -hmm. I want to explore having another guy in bed that a guy who really cares for his partner is going to say yeah okay let's explore that absolutely yeah. you hear that absolutely. 
<laughs> you have to let a woman know that her power is her sexuality. It's That's one right. of her powers. One. one of them. So you, you start off with this guy who's a friend of yours. Sure. How do you go on? You know, what, what was that like? I said I wanted to try, experiment. And he said, oh, I, I know someone. And I said, OK. And I said, I know someone, too. How about you? <laughs> yeah, she <laughs> sure did. So how was he when you said? You know, he, how said would you yes, like? he said yes, all too yes, fast. Yes, yes. <laughs> Real fast. <laughs> Before he got the question out of his mouth. I was like, was there a memo? <laughs> was there something I didn't know about? <laughs> so you, you start off with that, and then women. When Had you had sexual experiences with other women before, Wanda? I experimented there, too. We had a week-long blowout. Yes. Yeah, but what's the conversation like afterwards? You know, after you've done all the hot and stuff, what do you, what do you sit about? You know, hey, you want to to watch the game tonight? Or, well, I mean, <laughs> how does that go? <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Yes. Yeah. Is, you know, it, is it awkward at first? It must have been a little, did you not question, the, are we doing the right thing? Or? No, because I'm very comfortable in my skin, mm. and so is he. You're very and sexy in your skin, too, I'm sorry. <laughs> thank, you. <laughs> thank you. And we're two very secure people, so I feel like if I can enjoy this experience, I want to share it with him as well, and I want us to both enjoy it and grow together. So it's kind of, area. initially it sounds like it started as what some people would label swinging. No. No. No swinging. No? Let me separate it for people. Yeah. Swingers are a whole cult of people who just go to swingers clubs or swingers cruises mm -hmm. or swingers beaches and they just swap partners indiscriminately. Right. We're not that. No. Oh. Open marriages are people who can copulate, this is a safe word, with anybody at any man. time and the, not tell the spouse yeah, that's about right. it. We're not that. Oh, no. right, okay. No. Polyamorism, which is as old as the Bible. I mean, Solomon had, what, 2,000 wives? Is that what you're aiming for? Well. <laughs> <laughs> you better get the Viagra. I'm wearing my blue Viagra suit right now. Right? <laughs> no. Polyamory <laughs> is complete honesty and honor yes. and trust. Everybody knows about everybody. So let's let's get to the the spirit wives sure. um, mm -hmm. who we see there. Whose idea was spirit wives? How did we go from you know right. the Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, <laughs> Thursday thing to the spirit wives? I think some beautiful connections were made. Yeah, definitely. By who? We've been yeah. in probably 150 cities, 90 countries, and six mm -hmm. continents. Yeah. We've met a lot of people. So there's occasions yes. when you go, woo. woo. Yeah, and we do woo together. together. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Is it woo at men or woo at women? Woo at uh, women. Yes. I'm a straight male, bisexual mm -hmm. woman. Yes. So what happens if you go woo at a man? We've had, we've had men as guest stars yeah. in our bedroom. Yes. They just never got a permanent booking. No. <laughs> Males, are you just, you, you just stand back and watch? You know, when you have a woman's heart, it doesn't matter what kind of package the other dude has. That's right. That's really a fist, really. It's really a, it's a. So you can stand and watch Wanda make up with another guy. And that's I have. I've coached. Yes. I've instructed. I said, hey, that's not doing anything for her. Go to the left. Go to the left. <laughs> <laughs> be a lot of guys who are like oh come on if you mm -hmm. love somebody mm -hmm. how can you actually coach another man to have sex most guys are up and ready to fight this is the type of person he is he knows that my love is not going anywhere it's there forever to stay till death do, do us part oh. I've been to the three rings of marriage <laughs> the engagement ring? ring yeah the wedding ring Don't and the it? suffering <laughs> 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 Let's come back to the spirit wise. There's a ceremony, I understand. The ceremony is a six minute ceremony. It's, uh, it's very do? spiritual. Mm. What do you and do? we're both in the nude, and I say a little prayer, and the name comes to me because I connect to their spirit, and I give them a name. Ah, so you come up with the names, yeah. Yes, and uh, I kiss them on the forehead and the heart, and the ceremony is over. And all it signifies is the crossing of one day to the other, mm -hmm. from one life to another. So how do you pick who's going to sleep? Do you sleep with any of the women? Do you have sex with the women as well? 
Some. Who picks? Do you have a, like a roster on the wall? No. No. <laughs> no. no, no, no. <laughs> it's it's yeah. impromptu. Unlike the sister wives, we right. are the sister, sister wives. wives. <laughs> 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 Is it just a? It's a. It's a man thing. Well, no, but no. then they go. It's, well, it's got to be a cult. They must get high together. We have been lifelong non-drinkers, non-smokers, and non-drug users our whole entire life. Mm -hmm. Okay. Which is probably why, at 49 years young, my wife looks as good as she does. Stand up for a second. Why don't you stand up? Oh, you work out. Do you feel though, in, because you're, you know, I, I'm older than than you, but do you you are a fair bit older? You could be these spirit wives' as mom. Do you Easily. feel that you have to keep in shape? These women may be half my age. However, I'm twice the woman they will ever be. Woo! I said it. Did I stutter? <laughs> <laughs> Do you, so you make sure they know who is the queen? <laughs> it's, oh, that's no. a yes. It's not like that. It's not really it's like, not like no. that. No. I, I think they these, recognize, these women, though. I, I love them, and they're just wonderful. We're going to meet them. After the break, we are going to meet Eric and Wanda's four spirit wives. So stay with us. Woo! Coming up, we meet the first two spirit wives. Amora, I really like sex. And Satire. Everybody knows I'm crazy. And later, you cannot get five beautiful women under one roof without claws coming out or a little bit of jealousy. Is this really one big happy home? In a perfect world, it would just be you and Eric. <laughs> yes. We didn't have a threesome, but now you think he's still sleeping with the other woman. If so, call The Trisha Show at one 855 That's one 487 4742 One man, five wives, on an exclusive Trisha. who live a uh, polyamorous lifestyle, meaning that they live with and have sexual relations with four other women who they call their spirit wives. So we're about to meet the two women who've been part of the fabulous Floyd family, the longest. Please welcome Amora and Satai. Welcome, ladies. Hi, okay. Trisha. Hi. Now, Amora, you were the, the first out of the, the four ladies we're meeting today. How did you meet these guys? I just saw their lifestyle. I'm a very sexual person. I like. I really like sex. So, yes, let me. If you do it right, <laughs> we're doing right. It's good. So, how, how, how do you go? How do you go from being an employee to being sexual with? I don't know. Who were you sexual with first? I was sexual with Eric. First. So you said, this is what I believe. What were your words? I said, we, we both feel an attraction. We can move upon that attraction with my wife's blessing and maybe even her participation. Are you down? I did ask Wanda, though, before she did. I did, did. ask her if it was okay, just to make sure everything, you know, people say stuff, and then so when you, you get down to it, it's like, oh, no, nah, I don't want Wanda coming out with a razor trying to cut me or <laughs> nothing like that, so, lazy, like, you know. So <laughs> you two it get it on, and Wanda, mm -hmm. what, you're, you're... Participating. Oh, you, 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 you participated as well. Satai, how did you, uh, who did you meet first? Eric. We were actually at a old school party in Vegas. Yeah. And once he saw me, he's like, oh, you're great, are you coming to the show? And I'm like, yeah, whatever. He's like, well, come into my VIP section and, you know, meet my wife. And I'm gay. I don't need one. I'm not looking at him. You know, I'm like, um... So you only have sex with one, though. <laughs> so Ty does organically prefer women. And we get along great because we would often find women together. Also, so Ty seasonally, really, at one point, she was like, listen, you get one in the spring, one in the summer, one in the fall, and one in the winter. And that's it. Yeah, but that's you know, it. it isn't about... Quantity, it's quality. <laughs> <laughs> now, 
safe sex. Yeah. Are you ever worried about sexually transmitted diseases mm -hmm. with this all going on? Everyone's Can we tested. Get tested. Mm -hmm. So you don't use condoms? I love how you say this. Say condoms again. That was beautiful. That's beautiful. <laughs> <laughs> she said, she had an awful I know. Condoms. <laughs> <laughs> sexy. <laughs> so James Brown. <laughs> It's beautiful. No, really, do, 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 you use, do you use condoms? <laughs> yeah, what, do, what you must do to, to, otherwise you'd be having babies all over the place. Well, not necessarily. I mean, the, when you know what you're doing, you can, you can get out in time. It's, it's rhythm for a reason. I'm a dancer. Are you kidding? <laughs> so, four spirit wives. Yes. Who picks up the tab? I have two teenage, well, one 23-year-old daughter, and no, she's not becoming a spirit wife she will be stepping elegantly over my dead body in order to do so but uh, I also have a, a, a 19 year old two women two women in our house and it costs me a small fortune okay. these ladies are beautifully decked out okay. they must you know use okay. water electricity all the rest of sure. it um, how how much does that cost a, a week? You reckon? Um, uh, a week you love? A month? My a wife, day? my wife Wanda. First of all, the show Satai met me at in Vegas is called Eric Floyd's Old School Party. Yeah. I produce the shows. Yeah, but how much do they cost? The shows or the women? No, the women. Well, that's what I'm the trying rocks. to explain. Yeah. We make money doing the shows, so it's not like they're costing me a lot of money because we all work with my company that's generating a lot of money. Right. But as far as like what it costs a month? Yeah, the bills, yeah. I, well, I never really thought about that. When you have a wife, when you have a spouse, I should say, yeah. you don't think about how much is my spouse costing me a month? <laughs> <laughs> so let, let me ask both Satai and um, Amora. Amora. What do your friends and family think of this? My friends love Eric. And Satai, what about your friends and family? What um, everybody knows I'm crazy. I run my life, okay? Yeah. So my mom is like, my daughter, you know, she could do whatever she wants. I mean, hey, I'm grown. <laughs> come back we will meet Eric and Wanda's two other spirit wives Integra and Charisma and we'll also meet Eric's son Siamese so stay with us coming up Meet in Tigra. I live in Vegas, so everything goes on Vegas. And Charisma Sky. Wow. I like to cuddle. How do they make it work? I can go to Wanda and get babied. Then I can come to her and get a massage. I can come to her. And does anyone get jealous? You cannot get five beautiful women under one roof without claws coming out or a little bit of jealousy. Call the Trisha Show at one 855 that's 1-855-487-4742. Partners are cheaters. India can't handle the truth about her girlfriend, Q. And is Jim a cheater or just a flirt? Next, Trisha. One man, five wives on an exclusive Trisha. and Wanda who've been married for 27 years to each other and also share their lives, their homes, their bedrooms with their four spirit wives. Now we've met the two who have been with them the longest so now let's meet the newest members of the fabulous Floyd family Integra and Charisma. <laughs> Okay, now, Char no, Charisma, you're the newest, so I want to start with Integra. Uh -huh. And you came up with all these names? Yes. Okay, so is she a tigress or something? In tiger? Oh, by spirit, yes. In spirit. Yes, spirit. Okay, so who did you meet first and how did you meet? Well, I met both of them. I was working at a hotel and uh, they came in and I assisted them with their needs. Uh, they pulled me aside and... and you're still assisting them. <laughs> <laughs> yes, yes I am, yes I am. Everybody. Yes. Um. <laughs> Are you bisexual? Yeah, I mean... I, I, I love Wanda. Yeah. Ish. <laughs> so... <laughs> so you go to Wanda and you 
say, I've got my eye on this young yeah. lady. I said to Wanda, did you check out the girl in the VIP lounge? And she says, yeah, I did. I said, she's okay. beautiful. I want to hear the actual words. Listen, <laughs> we have been fancying each other for the last two weeks. We've been setting up this show. And I could tell that we want to go a little further. You should know that I'm married. I'm sure you already know that because Wanda is producing these shows with mm -hmm. me. Wanda and I would accept you into our home, into our heart, and into our adventures with open arms if you are a willing participant. Now, you might think you're just signing up for sort of Disneyland or something like that. <laughs> but in a way, it is. How do you get to that? How do you get to that? Do, do you do all that? And you, you, you do all of that, and you say all of that, and then you, you sort of said, P.S., we also want to have sex with you or something. You know? No, no I, yeah. I know sex keeps being dropped like the bomb, but really, sexuality is the least of it. Oh. Spirituality is the most of it. Integra, what do your friends and family think of your situation now? Your life well, family? friends, um, my family, it's the life that I've chosen. If I'm happy, they love it. Okay, let's move to uh, Charisma Sky. You're the newest. You've I been am. part of this family, if you like, for how long? Uh, officially about six weeks. Only about six weeks? You're a newie. Yeah. So what's it like coming into this... All these guys have been together much longer. What's it like being the new girl? When you first, you know, wake up in, in, in the, your own bedroom, I'm guessing you have? Yeah. And, you know, how do you know what to do? How do I know what to do? We, I, I love these girls. No, but we've in known the each morning, other. You know, we've known each other for years, and I just uh, recently moved into the household. So, how do you decide who's gonna go to whose bedroom? It just happens, and well, I'll answer that one. I mean, <laughs> everybody's going to that. <laughs> go ahead, well, Scott. take it away. Um, pretty much, I decide who I want. I like every day of the week I, I like a different girl me personally like if I could have that's why I love being in the family because I can go to Wanda and get babied then I can come to her and get a massage I can come to her and hang out and we like to come have sexual relations with her really well yeah. and then she likes to join us so we do like this three thing and yeah. then yeah what about if it, it, you know I'm sorry to be boring and down to earth what if it's um, someone's time of the month Oh, then oh, yeah. gotta stay somewhere she else. To, she yeah. better go in the room. Bye. Bye. You can't be here. <laughs> you can't play right now. Okay, what about now? What about jealousy? Because you cannot get. I'm sorry. I don't. I refuse to believe you cannot get one, two, three, four, five beautiful women under one roof without claws coming out or a little bit of jealousy. It happens. I'll just preface it by simply okay. saying, the art of jealousy is one where, obviously, you are mentally in a lower spot. Mm -hmm. If you just simply raise your awareness up, you find that there's nothing to be jealous Only about. Only a guy could say that. No. <laughs> no. Okay. <laughs> you put women together. I went to an all-girls school. You cannot put women with all their moods and their highs and trust without a little bit of... I don't oh, forsake it, like, it. jealous, like, you know, where I want to, you know, fight them or be like, oh, my God, I can't believe that you're with him. But, you know, there's some times where I'd be like, okay, well, in that. the back Happy of my times. mind, you know, I so, wanted to be with times. him. But it's not, you know, it's not like, oh, I'm going to start mm -hmm. drama, unnecessary drama, or make a big issue about it, you know. Let, me, let, are, me, let me tell you mm -hmm. something. And we did pre-interviews with everybody here. Mm -hmm. And one of the questions my producers asked everybody was, mm -hmm. um, who is the favorite? Do you have a favorite? Oh, yeah. Yes, I am. Me. me. <laughs> me? No, 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 no. I come back to that me. question of jealousy and a little bit of things between the women. Really, because you all did say that you thought you had to be the favorite. I am. No, I am. He just he really is. Is. He can't, you know, tell <laughs> That's good. You know, really he won't am. tell you. He won't tell you, but, but we, know we all know. Who, who is the favorite? I, I am. I am. I am. <laughs> <laughs> said to any one of them, you are my favorite. Now, that would incite jealousy. Right. Okay. Mm -hmm. How do you, do you two have sex often, just as man and wife on your own? Sure. Yes, we do. Yeah? yeah? Lots. Mm -hmm. And Just backstage, actually. <laughs> um, now, if you think that having a date night for a married couple is sometimes problematic, <laughs> what happens when a man with five wives goes out to dinner? It's an amazing yep, time. with all of them. Yes, yeah, stay tuned. You'll find out.
<laughs> Coming up, what's date night like with five wives? A family that lays together, stays together! <laughs> All your questions will be answered. How do you satisfy all five of them? And later, is sharing truly caring? Who is the favorite? I, I am. am. But if you just simply raise your... Do you think having multiple wives is a form of cheating? Call in now and voice your vote. Call 1-855-2-TRISHA and let us know whose side you're on. And while you're on the phone, you will also receive some valuable offers. That's 1-855-2-TRISHA. What's your vote? Closed captioning provided by... Alan. Well, I've got a ticket just for you. Come see The Trisha Show live in Stamford, Connecticut. For free tickets, call 203-905-655 or go to thetrishashow.com. One man, five wives on an exclusive Trisha. Well, you know, I've been doing television for, well, as long as Wanda and Eric have been married, and sometimes I think I've seen it all. So uh, here's the question. What's date night like in the Floyd household? Well, last night, the fabulous Floyds allowed us to tag along for a, a night out on the town. Finally. I know. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. <laughs> All right, so we'll have the usual, the yeah. family special. Let's open right. some appetizers right now. We we'll start from there. When am I gonna have some grandchildren? Oh, you still have children of your own. You don't need my grandchildren. grandchildren. Get the hell on with it. You ain't getting no Girl, younger. You know you're trying to use a machine. You're gonna waste your best right. years. <laughs> you told me to give you this. Pass it on. Pass it on. Pass it on. Pass it on. So the toast is. A family that lays together, stays together! Has anybody seen Wanda? Has anybody seen Wanda? Has anybody seen Wanda? family listen there's one thing I'm, i want to come to the audience in a minute one thing i'm trying to sort out take me through who sleeps with who well. i like to cuddle <laughs> so okay so let's let's start with uh, youngest charisma who do you have sex with eric i'm i'm with eric yeah one down the rest to go wanda wanda yes she just always wants to have my woman's uh uh, favoritism. This is my wife. This is who I. So I'm you're for. really like into the king. relationship for Wanda. Really yes. Wanda's your your. Well, these are all we're my wives, though. But, but, but you love Wanda. Yes. Okay. We all and love each other. We all and love each other. But I love, yeah, like, I love my other love wives too. But Wanda's what? But this is my main wife. This is my number one. Okay. And favorite. In a perfect world, it would just be you and Eric. In a perfect world, yes. <laughs> but I'm with Eric. I have to go to some of the men first. I go absolutely right have to. <laughs> I want to hear how they're going to go home to their wives oh, and say, you know what, honey, I want to embrace your sexual freedom. If you want to get with my best friend, I'm down with that. <laughs> how does your son does not have the feeling to be sexually attracted to your other wives? Okay. Good question. Uh, yeah, uh, we're going to meet him later. Yeah. Sure. Uh, my son has a very beautiful girlfriend. Uh, she's a beautiful young Latin pop star. Her name yes. is Christine Morell. And Christine and, is um, the best And he's very opposite of me. He really likes to be monogamous with one person. Yeah. 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 What did he want to say? 
This man has a question. Yes. How do you says, satisfy all five of them? No one has sex every day. Nobody. The women also know how to satisfy themselves. They satisfy each other. And yes, I do have sex a lot. Probably disproportionately more than the average man because of my circumstance. What, one today, and twice a day? <laughs> it can happen, it can happen four only. times, five times a day. Four, five times a day. Times a day. When there's time, but we work hard. Yes. Are you looking for any more wives? Uh-oh. <laughs> there's always room for one more. <laughs> You, you think it's a great idea? Yes. Yeah. What is it that attracts you that you uh, don't have to, you know, you can sort of not feel, I've got a headache tonight, go with her or something, you know? No, it's just they share a life together. It's not just, you know, they're, we they love fun. each we other. Have so much we you have like that? Yes. So much love. To yeah, they live our together. They, mm. They're in harmony. It's Thank spiritual. You. It's beautiful. Thank Thank you. Beautiful. Yes. Come here, baby. Come here. Eric, here's a question. Does a potential spirit wife have to be a woman of color? No, not necessarily. I would, I would, women I are women are it women. Happen. All right. We, we, we're just going to move on because we're going to take a break here. But as promised, after the break, we're going to meet Wanda and Eric's son, Siamese. Now, he's going to tell us what it's like being the only son of a man who has... Five wives. <laughs> yeah. Coming up, what's it like when dad has five wives? Naturally, I was like, okay, what's going on here? <laughs> <laughs> Eric's son is here. You're in, in a relationship now. I am. Will the next generation continue the tradition? You got yours, I got mine. Promotional consideration provided by in friend pressuring you into having a threesome and it's destroying your relationship if so call the trisha show at 1-855-4-TRISHA that's 1-855-487-4742 one man five wives on an exclusive trisha okay we've been talking to the very unconventional fabulous floyds eric wanda amora Sate, Integra, and Charisma Sky. Now, they all share a marriage, a home, and each other sexually. <laughs> all right, well, now we're going to meet Wanda and Eric's only child together, Siamese. Uh, let me tell you, he's an entertainer, and he says his father is his rock, his best friend, and his role model. So please welcome Siamese. Um, how did you feel about the sexuality when the, the spirit wives came along? That didn't matter to me. You but know, as a teenager, when these beautiful women started turning up, did your eyes sort of go, yeah? Well, yeah, well, yeah naturally. I was like, okay, what's going on here? <laughs> <laughs> I was like, how can I get in? But once I realized, you know, what was going on, you know, separation of church and state, you got yours, I got mine. <laughs> so, yeah. <Church> <laughs> But you know, l love is what love does. So just to be surrounded by these brilliant women. And you're, you're and in a relationship now. I am, I am. And uh, who are you in a relationship with? She said, nicely segueing to this young lady. <laughs> Hi. Okay, you can stand up. Hi. Uh, so this is, this is Christine, who's been sitting in the audience. Uh -huh. and, and Christine, when boyfriend introduces you to mom and dad, I mean, did he tell you straight off the bat, this is mom and this is dad, and, and oh, who are all these ladies? Well, here's how it goes. Did he, how was that conversation? He explained kind of the situation. I had been there and realized the chemistry that everybody had. I didn't know that they were all in a relationship together. But you thought something's going on. I, I just didn't know why everybody was there all the time. Oh, there's all, <laughs> all these beautiful women at the uh, house. You know, I, I, of course. So, um, and then he, I kind of asked him, you know, well, you know what, what's everybody doing here? Yeah. Just out of curiosity. And you weren't shocked? And then he told me. Um, of course I was shocked. I was blown away, but I was actually really impressed because I thought, I saw how real it was. Yes. Oh, <laughs> yeah. Thank you, yeah. Christine. Thank you. When we come back, Siamese will perform his ballad, Please Don't Lie to Me. No. We'll see you soon. <laughs> 
coming up, an amazing performance from the youngest Floyd I don't want to fall in love. on Trisha. I don't want to fall in love. I don't want to... Time to voice your vote. The art of jealousy is one where, obviously, you are mentally in a lower spot. If you just simply raise your... Do you think having multiple wives is a form of cheating? Call in now and voice your vote. Call 1-855-2-TRISHA and let us know whose side you're on. And while you're on the phone, you will also receive some valuable offers. That's 1-855-2-TRISHA. What's your vote? Promotional consideration provided by... The Real Deal in Talk. For free tickets to The Trisha Show, call 203-905-6555 or go to thetrishashow.com. One man, five wives on an exclusive Trisha. Okay. Well, Siamese, I think it's time you show people the talent that got you your spot on The X Factor. Uh, he is Vegas' youngest headliner. Here is Siamese. times because a look comes across your face I find I have to repeat myself because you are in a daze tell me who is he you want let me know your plan <laughs> and now we back down the hardest part is over because i won't be around and you play in secret game oh and i couldn't believe my eyes a part of my heart had died baby I can see it in your eyes Any day, any hour you will break Living with a heavy heart I will understand If this is not what you want Let me know your plan your spouse involved in the swinging lifestyle and you are desperate to get out of it if so call the trisha show at 1-855-4-TRISHA that's 1-855-487-4742 are convinced their partners are cheaters india can't handle the truth about her girlfriend q we had sex three months ago are you serious? 
This is madness. You called yourself messed up, and I believe you. Is Jim a cheater or just a flirt? I'm a flirt, yeah. yeah. Attention whore, so yeah. Attention whore. Yes. Whore. Yeah. That's an interesting choice of words. On the next Trisha. Stop yelling at the TV screen and come speak your mind in person. For free tickets to The Trisha Show in Stamford, Connecticut, call 203-905-655 or go to thetrishashow.com. One man, five wives on an exclusive Trisha. I'd like to thank Eric, Wanda and their spirit wives for coming today, giving us a glimpse into their unconventional family life. Now, if you want to find out more about today's guests and their upcoming events, you can go to our website at www.thetrishashow.com. And you can also see a special web-only performance from Siamese. So thank you for watching. We're going to say goodbye. <laughs>
start grooving. Give it to me. Give it to me, baby. 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 Baby, baby. Make it harder. You had enough. Give me that stuff, that funk, that sweet, that funk, that stuff. Give me that stuff. That funk, that stuff. I'm about to bust it, baby. It involved a couple named Wanda and Eric Floyd who'd been married for 27 years. Now Wanda and Eric came here to share with us their secret to a happy marriage. So what was it? Eric had four other wives. Swingers are a whole cult of people and they just swap partners indiscriminately. Right. We're not that. Oh. Open marriages are people who can copulate with anybody. At Mail any man. time and not tell the spouse yeah, about it. Right. We're not that. Oh, right, okay. No. Polyamorism, which is as old as the Bible, and the Solomon had what, 2,000 wives? Is that what you're aiming for? Well, <laughs> <laughs> polyamory is complete honesty and honor and trust. Everybody knows about everybody. Is it awkward at first? No, because. I'm very comfortable in my skin, mm. and so is he. You're very and sexy in your skin, too, I'm sorry. <laughs> Thank you. I've been to the three rings of marriage. The engagement rings? ring, yeah. the wedding ring, Don't and the it. suffering. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like if I can enjoy this experience, I want to share it with him as well. And I want us to both enjoy it and grow together. He knows that my love is not going anywhere. It's there forever to stay. Till death do, do us part. Well, now 
it was time to meet Eric and Wanda's four spirit wives and hear about who was sleeping with whom. How do you decide who's gonna go to whose bedroom? It just happens. I can go to Wanda and get babied. Then I can come to her and get a massage. I can come to her and hang out and have sexual relations with her really well. Yeah. And then she likes to join us. So we do like this three thing. You cannot get one, two, three, four, five beautiful women under one roof without claws coming out or a little bit of jealousy. The art of jealousy is one where, obviously, you are mentally in a lower spot. Mm -hmm. If you just simply raise your awareness up, you find that there's nothing to be jealous Only about. Got Sexuality is the least of it. Spirituality is the most of it. Do you have a favorite? Oh, yes. yes, I am. Me. Me. <laughs> me, Liz, you know we me. all know. Who, who is the favorite? I, I am. am. I am. <laughs> Are you looking for any more? Uh -oh. <laughs> There's always room for one more. <laughs>